Hey, good morning, guys. Got you with me out here on my uh, morning walk. I'm headed up the street towards the uh, Franklin Mountains. Figured I wanted to talk to you this morning about... Uh, by the way, it's cold. It's like 40-some-odd degrees, 45, 48. Anyways, uh, all that to say this. There was a song when I was coming up called OPP. Now, I'm going to change the uh, acronym to other people's problems. One of the ways, as you're growing up, you're taught as younger men, sometimes you can be given what's called the white knight syndrome, where you're supposed to come in and rescue people who need help. That is not true. That is a fallacy and a way for you to waste a lot of your time, energy, effort, and especially your money. So I'll title this, we're not down with OPP anymore, other people's problems. And uh, you're not responsible for the world. And this all stems from after uh, rolling yesterday in the morning and in the afternoon class hang on i gotta say good morning morning ma'am the uh guys we sit around on the mat and there were people young men asking questions and the same reoccurring question came up and all it was was the women in these young men's lives were using the g out of signs which is guilt to try to guilt the guys into helping them out of a problem that those women put themselves in which I just anyways that's yesterday is when I came up with the uh, other people's problems and then uh, one of the guys said like the old song and I was like let me change hands the old song and I realized that I'm actually old. <laughs> so anyways, we're not down with OPP. You know me. They're on their own. You guys stay safe and healthy. Take care of each other if you can. And if you can't, you take care of yourself. For the prize. You're more important than any of them want you to believe. So I got to get after it now. Uh, stay safe and healthy. Take care of each other if you can. And if you can't, take care of yourself. Like a fart in a G-string. From cold ass El Paso, Texas. I'm out of here. I don't understand how February can be warmer than, uh, what are we in, March? Yeah, we're in March, right? All right, anyways, bye-bye.